Good evening, Raspberry Heads. Today we're going to be talking about how to set up Wi-Fi on your RetroPie, so get ready. Alright guys, so once you set up your RetroPie for the first time and you've set up your controls, first thing you're going to want to do is go to the RetroPie selection here. And we're going to open that up. And what you're going to do is uh, you'll find a host of different options here, but what we care about here is the Wi-Fi um, bit here. So what we're going to do is we are going to uh, create a file on your Windows PC, and it will just be a lot easier to transfer over your Wi-Fi uh, settings here. So uh, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go and pause this video and uh, get Windows uh, 10 up so you can see the file creation here. All right guys, so once you've plugged in your SD card to your Windows PC, you're gonna find a boot drive. You're gonna open that. And this is gonna be your RetroPie uh, files here. You're going to scroll down. What you'll do is you'll copy one of these text files and you'll rename it to Wi-Fi key file. And once you've done that, you're going to clear that file out and you're going to type in SSID equals in quotations. You'll put in the Wi-Fi name or domain that you have and then PSK equals in quotation your password for your uh, Wi-Fi settings. So once you've done that, uh, you will uh, go back to your RetroPie and you will uh, select that Wi-Fi uh, selection that I was uh, showing you. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, boot that back up so you can see it and we'll continue on. All right, so what you're gonna do is uh, go back to your RetroPie option and you're gonna select Wi-Fi. What you're gonna see is three options uh, to connect to Wi-Fi, disconnect, and then import Wi-Fi credentials. What you'll do is you'll just hit the uh, number three uh, which you could also push F3, I believe, to go straight there, but just uh, push the down arrow until you hit three and then push uh, enter. And it will take a moment to load, but it will uh, sign into your Wi-Fi and you will have access to uh, downloading themes and adding things to your, uh, you know, your folders uh, via Wi-Fi. As long as you're connected to your Wi-Fi uh, at your home, uh, you will have access. So that is it on connecting Wi-Fi and we'll catch you next time.